We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Atlanta Braves and the Los Angeles Dodgers. The Dodgers continue their incredible hot streak today as they attempt to secure their 16th straight win right after this. <coughs> Yo, what is up, YouTube? I hope you guys Alex are having Wood. a fantastic Tuesday, guys. Alex Witters, our pitcher in, in tonight's contest. game. This is his 12 star 8 0. 2.96 ERA, 70 innings, 56 hits given up, 52 hits, 62 strikeouts in one walk. He's had a great year on the mound so far. Can we continue it here against the Braves? As Ozzy Albies will lead off the top of the first, hitting 317. The Braves are 31 and 30 coming into this game. They're trying to stay above 500, so they really need to win this game as this one hits the left field. Chris Taylor will run all the way over there. The catcher for the first out, so one out here in the top of the first. And uh, the Braves really need this win, so this lineup is Albies, Marquez, Freeman, Acuna Jr., Swanson, Duvall, Archivaria. Flowers and Max Free. There's no other way to say it. And he now that will bring in Mark, Nick Markakis hitting 293. The they expect and the first pitch and will so be strike one on the outside corner. Unless he starts to get hot. Oh, Dan one. Dino, you check out this Dodger Dino, team one, as they play here tonight. All you and can now really one, say one. is they've been on one heck of a one, run. One. Matty, this is to the Max best Free. team in baseball I mean, Nick right Markakis, excuse me. I don't know why I said Nick. I don't know why I said Max Free. I guess I was thinking about him. Free. I guess I was thinking about him. 2-1. And the 2-1 pitch will be fouled from Markakis. Alright, 2-2 knuckle curve. And the knuckle curve will and be three and so two. Pitch inside. Freddie Freeman is game. on deck. And the three two pitch from Wood will be a strikeout with the changeup. Two, two outs in the top of the first first K for Alex Wood in this game. So, so next two outs, and now that will bring in Freddie Freeman. Hitting 300. And the first in pitch to the, the phenomenal now, first baseman will be strike one. From Alex Wood. A one to Freddie Freeman in the 0 1 knuckle curve will be fouled back for strike two. Alright, 0 oh, 2 to Freddie Freeman in the 0 2 changeup will be hit the center, center field. Bellinger on the run. Bellinger and Bellinger will catch it to end the top of the first. So, a 1 2 3 inside. inning for Alex Wood, and uh, hopefully, our offense can get first. started hot the early Dodgers in this game. Oh, Max Freed, the pitcher for Max the Freed, Braves. The this is his tough start. State. Two and That's six, 4.40 ERA. Zach, Having a rough year, 59 hey, innings had a really solid of work, season. 21 walks, 66 strikeouts, and 58 strike hits. Man, uh, Mookie Betts will lead this that, game off coming into really tonight's well game, in being first in the so NL for home runs, and actually first will tie for first with RBIs as well coming into this game with 54. So here we go, Max Freed. Let's see what he can do here. First pitch of his night, and the first pitch to Betts will be low for be ball one. one. So great start from Rookie Betts right there, taking a ball, and that's, that's a good way to start on, the, on offense, and now 2-0. and oh, so. Now two yeah, out of bets. After the first four games on this road trip, they find Bro, Matt Beatty and Betts have been on such a tear for the team too, by the way. Two oh, and, and this one's hit to right field. This direction. one will be caught probably from Nick Markakis, which it will be it for the first the out. The first but down. Matt Beatty. All right, this is our lineup real quick. Betts, Turner, Beatty, Bellinger, Seager, Taylor, Muncy, Smith, Wood. That is our batting lineup tonight. But guys, uh. First pitch from Freed to Turner will be outside for ball one. This lineup but today uh, the, opposing the way Matt Beatty and Betts have been playing is so phenomenal. They're both on a tear. Every time Matt Beatty hits a home run, it feels like Betts hits a home run the same game. If Betts hits a home run, it's like Matt Beatty hits a dinger. So it is pretty crazy. They are both fighting for first with home runs in the NL. And this one will be fouled. So now 2-1 to Justin Turner hitting 355 coming into this game. And the 2-1 pitch from Max Freed will be 2-2 too, too high. Good. Great pitch right there. Got ahead. me to now swing. So two that, two. I'll say it's a good pitch. 2-2 two, two to Justin Turner. And the pitch from Max Freed will be fouled. Another one sent foul. 
two two in the two two Ready pitch in next three. And now three and two great take from Turner on that Beatty on deck. Hitting four thirty one. Like three you two in the pitch, pitch on next three. We'll be hit down to third, third and that Javaria will make Javaria. a nice play. And yeah, a wild throw and Turner will be safe. So that's an E6, E5 on Achavaria right there. Five. Tried to get a little fancy with the throw. I don't think that was necessary. Now they'll bring in Matt Beatty. He's hitting 431. 25 home runs and 52 RBIs this season. Man, if this dude ain't an MVP candidate, bro, I don't know what he did wrong this season. He's been having such a great season. Mookie Betts. And him should both be MVP candidates. And maybe Walker Buehler. Why not? All right, first pitch first to pitch Matt Beatty. Will be foul. Off to the right. Strike one to Matt Beatty. Last night's games has scored 11 runs. Here's the 0 -1, 0 1 pitch. And Big hits the right field. And this this one's high, to deep to right field. Deep. This right might not get Marquez. out. Nick Marquez will catch it. Turner tagging. And catch. Turner will be safe at oh, second. So we second, do get a tag time, run right there. So Bellinger up, might have a way, I mean, a way easier, I mean, an easier chance getting in Turner with a single, hitting 338, 23 home year, runs and like 48 Bellinger. RBIs. Having an all right season so far. The start the of it, it was comes. bad, but he's been able to get comfortable at the plate and he's been tearing the ball off, man. He And uh, he's been doing really good, 1-0. And the 1 0 pitch from Freed, 2 0 high. How the Flowers catching tonight for the Braves. 2 0. And the 2 0 pitch from Max Freed. Turner's leading the, the pitch. Will be hit. This might drop. Oh, uh, nope. Adam Duvall will catch it to end the bottom the of the first. And uh, still 0 0 going into the top of the second. And Ronald Acuna, Acuna Jr. will lead off the top of the second, hitting 271, 14 home runs, 36 RBIs, and fourth in all-star voting for center Ready fielders. And the pitch. first pitch, will Acuna Fly Jr. The be at the all-star game? 0-1, and the 0-1 pitch. The knuckle curve will and be fouled off. Behind is really quite an athlete. Right, Not only does Ronald he drive the ball Jr., great the change up power, will strike him out looking. I mean, one out you here in the really top fly. of the second. Yeah, Maddie, Two strikeouts for Alex Wood. That's where I was going with. And now Dansby Swanson will be hitting fifth, hitting 280, seven home runs this season, 15 RBIs. And his, his batting average looks pretty solid, but the stats with the home runs and the RBIs could be a little bit better for Dan Swanson, but he is an average baseball player. I don't think he's elite. And 0-1 uh, to Swanson in the 0-1 pitch will be now 1-1. One one. One one. But he's a very good ball player. I wouldn't mind to have him on my team either. 1-1, one, 2-1. One. One. He just seems like such a respectful two kid. And, and uh, yeah, 2-1 now to Dan Swanson in the 2-1 pitch. Will be fouled off now, two ball, and two. And now perhaps needs to shorten up with two, right, two, two knuckle curve from Alex Wood will be hit now and fouled. Line to the left side. Foul. All right, two, two to Dansby Swanson. The high fastball from Alex Wood will be line hit to center field. center field. And Bellinger but will catch it for, for the him, second out. Will head straight to the center so field two outs here in the top of the second. For the second out. And now that will bring in Adam Duvall having a so really, really rough Chugan season, hitting 178. Two home runs and five RBIs. This is a man where I feel like Atlanta has, you know, they, they do have, and I think they have, uh, Marcelo Zuna, I think they signed him, so... Surprisingly, seeing Adam Duvall hitting is a little a shocking. O2. I think they I signed has a lot of Ozuna. Mound, I don't know. I think they so did the O2 now to uh, Adam Duvall. That will be fouled action. off. No score here but I feel like if they two. can't get Adam Duvall to be swinging good this rest of the season, they need to trade him strikes, away for some prospects. Because he is a solid ball player. Or drop him or put him into AAA, make him, him work there as Wood will the check him out to end the to top end of the second. The and that will be the third strike out of the night for Alex Wood. 
All right, Corey Seager leading off the Ready bottom of the second, the hitting 421, and, the big time and uh, threat. having Seager. a pretty good season here in this 2020 Seager. year, hitting 421, like I said, 19 home runs, 45 RBIs, and he's been playing great baseball for Here's this club. First pitch, first pitch from Max Fried will be hit High to center field. To this one center. will probably Acuna be caught. Acuna will catch it he for the first out of the bottom the of the second. For the first one out. Of the so one quick out, and now that will bring. Let's look at their. No, let's not look at the replay. And now so that will bring Chris Taylor, second in center gone. field voting. And, and the crazy the thing about that is Chris he's Taylor. not even the starter. He's usually a bench First player hitting 338. It is just crazy. And he might Hold be at on. the All Star game. Hitting uh, Bellinger's first in voting, then CT3. I don't know who the third person is, but then it goes to Ronald Acuna Jr. I know that only because we're playing the Braves and I saw that. And I'm hoping in July Chris Taylor's playing here at Dodger one, Stadium one, in the All-Star Game. 1-1. One, one. And this one will be hit right back up the middle for a Line base driving. hit. That's a base hit in the center field. No mistake what he was sitting on looking for a dead red piece Man, of I love Chris Taylor so much that I wish I kind of made him a starter. Ah. But, Next bro, our team is so Muncie. solid, the just the starting the lineup. Year, Here comes Muncie hitting 346, 22 rates. home runs, 50 RBIs. Having a good season, kind of quietly, though. Like I said in a while, I said that a while ago in a couple videos, that Max Muncie's well. kind of our sleeping player. Here, I don't think a lot about him. But, bro, he comes in with such clutch hits. He hits a lot of dingers. And he's having a pretty pretty good season, and I'm just not, That's I'm really not know. visualizing that. Uh, like, it, he's having it, but it's just n nothing I really talk about. 2 out of Max Muncy. And the 2-0 pitch will be now 2-1 with the strike, fastball on the outside now. corner. Alright, 2-1. And now hit High popped up, and field. that will be the Acuna's second out. Acuna will run in and catch it for the second out. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Trucks. Striding into the box. Hi, Dowling and Will Smith hitting 317, nine home runs, 19 RBIs. And, two away. and surprisingly third in the all-star voting for catchers. When I, I just saw back. that, and, and I about spit my drink out because he's been struggling so bad. That I've even made, I've even had a thought about making Austin Barnes our starting catcher, or flip Chris Taylor's position and, and make Chris Taylor play catcher. I think that'd be pretty cool, but I'm gonna stick to what he plays and what he does for the Dodgers, playing in left field and pretty much playing all over. I'll just stick to him being my utility man because he's such a solid like utility all. man. And plus, I think you get a DH in the All-Star game, so Chris Taylor could be the DH for the NL All-Star team. Ready with the, the first, first pitch, pitch here it comes. will be hit, and oh, that's, that's not going to be the third out. That's going to be off Swanson's glove, and that will be a base hit. Hey guys, but now that will bring in the pitcher and Alex right Wood, I do not think hitting 167. On an oh, oh, get me over I, and he's but ninth in the exactly All-Star voting. First pitch from Max Fried will be hot. Will will be high, but it's strike one on the outside corner. With the slider, the that's a pretty good pitch. No Alex Wood's zone is pretty big too. So, 0 1 to Wood, and the 0 1 pitch from Max Free. And now 1 0 2. So, 0 2 hey, quickly to Wood in the 0 2 pitch right from Max Free. And nothing's a bigger backbreaker to a team. And strikes him out with the 96 that mile per hour fastball. And, and there's no seven. score through two. Here's yeah, Andy Echevarria leading off leading the top, the third inning, 178, the one home run, in seven RBIs for Echevarria. Having a struggling now. season with Atlanta, just like uh, Adam Duvall, really maybe, just one maybe, one he could turn that around back. here after the, the All-Star break, or maybe in June, I don't know, 1-1 one, one now. Oh, 1-1 one, one to Echevarria in the 1-1 one, one fastball. Will be fouled. fouled off again, and now he's in a one and two hole. All right, one two to Andy Echeverria. The knuckle curve will be fouled off. This is foul right side. All right, one Looking two. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the, the one two, two. changeup. Will be hit to right field, right. and Betts there to look will it catch it for the first out. out. One. All 
And now they'll bring in Tyler Flowers hitting 180, three home runs, and 10 RBIs. Man, a lot of these Atlanta Braves have been really struggling. It's crazy that they are first in their division. Like, Tyler Flowers, his average is bad. Archer Varillas is bad. Flowers is not Flowers. Well, Flowers is bad. But Adam Duvall, like, that is kind of crazy. Oh, two now. And the pitch will be one and two. Like, that is pretty crazy. Third inning, like three no batters with bad RBI, like I mean a bad batting average, like that, that I don't see a team doing good. But if Atlanta can keep it going and try and win this division, congrats to them. The one-two will be hit to Matt Beatty, and the throw and will be the second out. Two outs. All right, so two out, two in the top of the third, and now that will bring in Max Coming Freed hitting 158. Now, this guy is still First looking pitch, at a zero will be when they hit ball combo. one inside. And he misses inside with that one ball. 1-0. Oh. And the 1-0 oh pitch to Max Freed. A ball and a strike. Oh, yeah. Well located fastball right there. If he can continue to do that, he'll pitch right, deep one into one. this one. And the knuckle one curve, 1-2. Now now the Braves pitcher. Alright, 1-2. And the 1-2 one one pitch from... Wood will be fouled. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that All right, one. One two and the one two change from Wood. And be another off. foul ball. All right, one, one two. two. And the fastball will be fouled. All right, one two knuckle curve will be hit, and short. Seager will scoop it, throw it to first, and dirt, Max Muncy will have to make a nice scoop to end the bottom Braves of the third. I mean, the one, top two, of the third. Let's go to the bottom of the third. Betts leading it off. Here's Mookie 0 for Betts. 1 in this game. In his first at bat, so and the first pitch from Max Freed. Will be hit to left field. This one is carrying. With and this guy's it'll be caught. Power. One out. He's feeling pretty good at the dish. And now that'll bring him in Turner. 0 for 1. Reached there on an error in his last good. AB. First pitch from Max Freed. It'll be high. They'll Four ball one. Great eye from Destin Turner. But he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. 1-0. One -oh. And the 1-0 -oh pitch from Max Freed. Check and now 2-0 oh high. No swing, says the home putt umpire. Ball 2-0. Two. Two -oh. He would have had to go with the old school Tommy and Hulk approach -oh on pitch. that one if he wanted to get on top. But he was able Will to lay be off. Strike one, one with the slider. Behind Great pitch. The swing that time, and it's 2-1. 2-1. And, two and the 2-1 pitch from Max Reed. Now Will be 3-1. Matt Beatty on deck. It's 3-1. They know the threat this guy possesses. He won to Justin plate. Turner in the 3 1 pitch. In situation right here, but I can't imagine will be hit the left field for a base hit. So a single for Turner. Hit, one for and now that will bring in Max Free. I mean, Max Muncy. Yeah, oh my goodness. Right Muncy 0 for 1. And the right first pitch to Bailey. It will be about strike one. Six game hitting streak so far. <coughs> oh, one to Matt Beatty. And, and now well, Owen 2 really with the slider. The Great now. sliders like right two. there. Uh, Matt Beatty, 17 doubles this season. Tied for 6. The 0 2 pitch in. from Max Freed. Throw now over, and Turner will be safe. And he's back standing. Turner is. I, I don't really feel like Turner is the one to steal, so that's an interesting call right there from Max Freed and the Braves. But the 0 2 from Beatty. Two Beatty will be one and two. two. Pitch to him misses outside. Well, there's the classic and two to Matt Beatty. Fastball, not even close to the zone. We'll see what he throws on the and next And the pitch. one two Throw pitch will first, be thrown over to Turner. And now standing. one and two still. One two to Matt Beatty. Here's and the, the pitch one and two will be outside for ball two. So two two now to Matt Beatty. <clears throat> Max Freed with the pitch. 38th pitch of the game. First and uh, strike them out. As he swings through the curveball, two down. Big curveball for the strikeout there, and that came after an absolute the missile of a fastball. Even if you recognize the breaking ball out of the pitcher's hand, Bellinger. it's so hard for hitters to sit back long enough after they've seen a really good fastball. Only the best can keep their hands back on those. So here's Cody Bellinger. 
As he'll watch a slider that runs out of the strike zone away. Now that will bring one. Cody Bellinger 1 0. 1 0 to Bellinger. 0 for 1 in this game. And the 40th pitch for Max Free. Now the 1 0. And now 2 and 0. Fastball outside Bellinger, the 2019 MVP. Can he continue that here? 2 0. It's going to be hard though. Three Especially with now. Mookie Betts and not Beatty having first. such a tear this season, man. I love it. 3 0. The 3 0 pitch will be fouled and off for 3 1. Off. So the first strike right there. 3 1 to Cody Bellinger and the pitch for Max Freed. The 3 and 1 pitch. Will be hit Swing and fouled. So foul. full count now. Three, two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this three, pitch. Two. And the three two pitch. Will be and hammered to right field. This might be gone right. and it right. is. Mark Takis is gonna watch it. A two run home and run for Cody Bellinger. Twenty fourth one of the season, hit three hundred and ninety four feet. Right and he is one home run off from tying Betts and Beatty. Man, Bellinger, Betts, and Beatty. Yo, the triple B's, baby. Let's go. And now that will bring in Corey Seeker 0 for 1. First pitch from Freed will be hammered to right field. This one is hit hard. This one's gone. Nick Marquez should have watched that one. 3-0, 20th home run for Corey Seeker in this season. 376 feet. And 106 and miles per hour Seager. off the bat. That's how I knew it was gone, guys. It was just such a hard swing, and the ball was carrying so fast. Three-run lead, and now they'll bring in CT3. He's one for one. First pitch will be popped up, and that will end the bottom of the third, but we will score three runs off of two home runs. So let's go to the top of the fourth here. So two home runs in and the Ozzie Albies will lead off the, the top of the fourth. 0 for 1. And bring in the former top prospect, first pitch Ozzie from Alex Albies Wood. Two seam fastball the will be struck one. For their first base runner in this one. 0 no 1 to Ozzie Albies. And the 0 1 fourth seam fastball will be fouled. He has, but we'll see if this second trip through the order changes anything. 0 2 and the 0 2 knuckle curve. What kind of adjustments these hitters will be hit to right field and fouled. All right, 0 Here's two. another 0 2. And the changeup will strike him out. On one Missed out here in the top now. of the fourth. Fourth K of the well, game for going, Alex Wood. Also worth Looking to get his ninth win. win if this keeps up as we take which a look he at the probably might, I don't know. Three runs season. can change so see, quick in baseball. Right up there among league leaders All right. in that 0 for department. 1 is Nick Martakis, and the first pitch will, from Wood will be fouled for strike 1. Is it's fouled off to the left side. 01. The, the, the 01 knuckle curve from Wood will There's be high and now 1 and 1. Quite catch the inside. All right, 1-1 one, one from Nick Marquez and two Nick Marquez from Wood will be Stay fouled down off. Down the left field line. Right down and the pipe. I'm surprised Nick Marquez didn't take that ball for a ride. 1-2. One, two. One the change up right down the will be 2-2. Two two. Great eye. Count even at two and two. We're going back here with the changeup, no the two-two runs, two no pitch, hits, and one error on the Atlanta line will score. be hit to Pulled right center right field. Center Bellinger field. and Betts. Bellinger's in Bellinger pursuit. will catch he it for the second out. Really had to hustle to get to that one. Two I wonder if Bellinger now. said anything to Betts right there, that it was my ball or yeah, I don't know. Stepping up All right, now I'll bring in Freddie Freeman all for one. All for one in the ball game. 0 for 1 in this game in the first pitch well to Freeman. To the right. Here's the first pitch. Will be hit Bounces into the, the shift side. and Turner will throw it to first to Throwing end this dirt, inning. A so a 1-2-3 an inning for Alex Wood and yet down to give up any hits. Still down 3 nothing. Welcome back to Dodger Stadium. Let's send it down to the field in Heidi Watney. Matt, during the break I caught up with Dave Roberts, the Dodgers skipper, about his lineup's performance so far. And flat out, he was very pleased with the quality of their at-bats. They've been able to push across three runs to this point, but they've also made the opposition work extremely hard. He's thrown a lot of pitches, and they think they're going to have a good opportunity to push across a lot more runs as he tires or as they get into that bullpen. Thank you, Heidi. All right, one out of Max Muncy and now 1-1. One, one. One one. Oh. 
And now foul. A shot hit down the corner. Nearly a big fly to start the inning instead of foul ball. And now strike them out. The first out. Have the first out in the bottom of the fourth. Good, good pitch right there from Max Fried, and now they'll bring in Will Smith. One for one. First pitch will be low for a ball one. Really finishing that pitch like you're supposed to. Will Smith is at the plate oh, no. and he checks his swing for ball one. And now two and oh. Pitches a curveball that looked good from here, but it's two and oh. You'd never want to fall behind as a pitcher, but doing it to a Rolling guy like the this two -oh pitch is to even Matt. worse. I mean, to He's Will Smith would be three and oh. For the rest of this at bat, starting right now. Three out to Will Smith. And, and ball four, so four pitch walk, there, and four. now that'll bring in Alex Wood. And with the bases empty and three one. balls, I think they were probably just saying, "Hey, we're not going to no compound pitch. our mistakes here. Better issue a free pass and give him something to drive." Right, first pitch. Here's the first pitch. Will be strike one. Should have tried to lay the punt down. I pulled three back. Runs, five I hits. thought, no I thought it'd be ball, but all one now. Now a and a good bunt, here. and Will Smith. They're going to throw it a second. Run. And not get a double play. That was a smart play from Atavaria. Man, I would have thrown the first, but that's just me. 0 for 1. 0 for 2 is bets in this game. First pitch from Max Freed. Will be. Uh oh. Yeah, get back the first. And a nice job keeping it close. Tyler Flowers will make a nice play on that one. All right, the one up pitch will be fouled off now. One and one. One one, and now and one and two. One two pitch for Max Reed to Mookie Betts. One two. The one two, and now two and two outside. A lot of B's in this game, or M's. Mookie, Max, Muncy, Matt Beatty. <laughs> Like, I, I think that's how I'm getting some names side. confused every AB. Like Will Smith, I call him Matt, Matt Beatty for some reason. 2-2. Two, two. Two, two and now 3-2. Three and two. Good spot for Turner on deck. 3-2. And the 3-2 pitch. There goes three, two, Wood. Pitch. And hit and fouled. I want Wood to be you know, running here just in case I hit one of the gap. 3-2. And there goes the Wood, the pitch, he hit the, the left field, the and that will end the inning. I don't think that's deep enough or high enough. That's exactly what it will do. We'll get there, and he puts it away to retire the side. Dodgers leave one, but they're on top by a count of three to nothing. Welcome back. Heidi Watney standing by as we get set for the top of the fifth. Matt, I had a chance to discuss the Braves' offense with their manager, Brian Snicker, during the commercial break. And he was pretty blunt in saying they're just not having very good at-bats. They haven't had a single guy on base yet, so it's starting to feel a little desperate down here. But he said they've unfortunately just been faced with some really great pitching today. The key going forward is to find any way they can to get him out of his rhythm on the mound. Now, that may be a tall task, but they feel the little adjustments could lead to things turning around for them. All right, run over to the junior leading off the top of the Ready fifth. To 0 for 1 in the first pitch, pitch from Wood. Will be he strike one with the fastball, the fastball right down the middle. This guy's been throwing the ball great so far, but it's going to be tested here. Four, five, and the 0 1 pitch will be hit morning. hard, and Outside, that will get through. And, and that will end CT. I mean, um, that will end Wood's uh, get too many pitches no hitter going into the fifth. And now that will bring in Dan V. Swanson, first time pitching out of the stretch. And, and ball one. So first pitch out of the stretch one will be a ball. One zero and the one zero changeup. Two and zero. Two and zero. So quickly two and zero to Dansby Swanson. This kind of pop, you better be awfully careful. And the two zero knuckle curve will be strike one. Two balls and a strike. Two and one. Great pitch right there. Dave Roberts looking on right there, watching Alex Wood do his thing. The two one. And now this one's ripped down the line. And, and this might be trouble, or Ronald Acuna Jr. will stay at second. That is a pretty interesting thing to do. 
I don't know. I, I think I would try and run on CT3, and now they'll bring in the tying running Adam Duvall, who's 0 for 1. First pitch. It'll be hit hard. Seager will slip it to Beatty. The throw to first. A double play for Alex Wood. So, two outs now. Adam Duvall well, probably frustrated right there. Right there. The I would be too, and now that will bring in Andy Antavaria, who's 0 for 1. Like can he come through ball. with a big we'll hit the for the Braves? First now. pitch will be Here's ball 1, ball, according to the home plate umpire. That one was a strike, but we'll, I guess we'll call it what it is, 1-0. And now this one's hit to Turner. Turner will pick it up, throw to first. And a good inning, well, a great way to get out of that uh, jam right there from Wood with the double play and then the grounder to Turner and the throw. Just That was pretty good, and good job from Wood being able to get out of that inning, and now Turner will lead off the bottom of the fifth, one for two. First pitch will be hit to right center field. Acuna will actually go out there and catch it for the first out of the fifth. I hope you guys are having a wonderful Tuesday, guys, too, by the way. Uh, with everything that's going on in our world, uh, it's it's pretty stressful. The looting, the curfews, what Denver has. Uh, Colorado currently has curfews right now. Well, they did yesterday. They ended actually yesterday. Oh, is this one gone? No! Man, I thought it was gone. <laughs> <laughs> Two outs and now in the bottom of the fifth, and now they'll bring in Bellinger. But I hope you guys are staying safe out there. And, uh, you know, if you're protesting, please be safe. Don't. I really don't think the rioting is the best choice, but do you. But at the end of the day, just be safe. 1 0 to Cody Bellinger. And now 1 1. Alright, 1 1 to Cody Bellinger, and the 1 1 pitch from Freed and will be 1 and 2 according to the home plate umpire. Went I went around on that one, I could down. agree with the home plate umpire, honestly. I just, you know, always want to blame the umps. 1 2. And now and 2 and 2. Good job to lay off that 1 2 breaking ball. Alright, 2 2. Right back in this at and now 3 Full and count 2. To Bellinger, three balls, two strikes. 3-2 counts are usually a time to challenge the hitter, but I think he'll be careful here. Shoot for the corner, and if you miss it, so what? That's better than him. Hit and towel. Swing and a line drive, but this will land foul as he didn't miss by Max much. Max Freed doesn't want Bellinger to go yard like he did in one of his ABs already. And this line one will be hit to center, center field. field, but Acuna will catch Acuna it to end the bottom of the fifth. Have room out there as he so, puts this let's go to the top of the sixth. Here now is the catcher, Tyler, Tyler Flowers, Flowers done to lead it off. Out in the oh, one. For a lineup that really and the first pitch to Flowers this will be yeah, only two fouled so off far, for strike one. Not very many hard hit balls either. We'll oh, see if they one. can start making some adjustments. Grounded and this one's hit to Seeger in the throw to first. Will be on Throw time for the first stop. Him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. So Ender one out, and now that will bring in Ender and Ciarte. Man, I'm surprised he ain't getting starts. I know he used to be their starting everyday center fielder, but you know, I think you'd put him in right for Nick Marquez just to have a better speed guy out here, there. But, but or Adam Duvall in left, but they they, they stick to Nick Marquez. I mean. They Barely stick a Ender Anciarte on the bench, which is a very yeah, interesting move by Brian Sneakner or whatever I think that's his name is. This is going to be hit right back up the middle for a base hit. And uh, because, bro, you could pull out Adam Duvall and bring in a better right left. Well, you could bring in a better speed man and a better hitter, I think. And now that will bring in Ozzy Albies. Over two with the strikeout and a flyout. The first pitch will be hit to Beatty to throw to Seeger. And a double play. No, not a double play. We're going to get one out. That will be an error on Seeger, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. They didn't rule that. So, 0 for 2 is Nick Marquez's first pitch to him. Will be strike one. Might be an error on Corey Seeger. Not too sure. Uh. Man, that should have been a double play, but whatever. Oh, one pitch. to Marquez, and it's now this on one's hit, and, and the runner will not go to third, which I really feel like as slow as that ball was hit, he could have, but I don't know. Freddie Freeman, the tying run is up at the plate. This is a big moment here for Alex Wood. Two outs, runners on at first and second. This one hit to Max Muncy, and that will end the inning. So Alex Wood gets out of another jam.
And uh, good job from Alex Wood. All right, AJ Minter, the new pitcher, pitching 698. Uh, 26 game of the year, 3-3 record, 19.1 innings. And now that will bring Corey Seager. And we're going to start warming up our bullpen a little bit. Let's warm up. Let's go with Dustin May. Start, start warming him up in the bullpen. Hit it right on the screws. All right, let's see what Seager could do here. One for two with the home run. The first pitch from Minter will be strike one with the fast one. 98 miles per hour. Corey Seager first in the NL with all uh, shortstop votes. Uh, I'll take it, man. He deserves it. He's been playing great this season. 1-1 one, one now to Corey Seager. Uh, you know, and if you watched last year's franchise with this team, which a lot of you guys have, and I want to say thank you for sticking around for this uh, 2020 season and you know having a great time and you know watching me with the, all the energy in some games and some games where I feel a little bit low and I'm tired and you guys can tell but I don't get a lot of comments on that which I I want to say thank you and like sometimes if I mispronounce some dudes names I don't get a lot of hate for that either and I don't get any hate and I just want to say thank you guys for I just want to say thank you. I want to show my fan appreciation. You guys have done great watching this and watching me grind on this. 3-2 now to Corey Seager. But like I was getting to, if you watch last year's franchises, this one sits the right field. And you're watching this one. You could obviously obviously tell that there's a big difference with me from Corey Seager from last year's game in MLB 19 to MLB 20. In MLB 19, I struggled so bad with Corey Seager. It was, like, there was moments where I wanted to throw him down in AAA, keep him there, and let him struggle for down there and not be on the team. But, in, but I did win a gold glove with him because he had such an amazing glove. But in this game, he kind of has both. He has the amazing bat, which he does in real life, which is his bat's pretty maybe above average in real life just a little bit above average and his glove is pretty good in real life too but in this game I, like I'm having better swing times I'm doing so much better this I'm hitting home runs I'm getting RBIs the defense is kind of little bit below average I think a little bit this season but if it's a basic ground ball I'm pretty sure any fielder could field it but when it comes to the diving plays like he's made a few this season and he's all, oh, this one's high to left field, but foul. And he's also made some Derek Jeter throws this season where he leaps off the back foot and makes the throw and making it look all pretty. So he's had a decent year just all the way around, and I'm pretty, I'm, I've am i been so, I've been so stoked the way he's been playing this season. And I hope you guys are too. And, like, I do miss, like, the one thing I do miss about not, uh, you know, this with having all this third. power on the team is this will be a double play ball one and two. One thing I really miss about having all this power in Betts and Bellinger and Jock is not starting Chris Taylor. I really do like Chris Taylor. I've always had a love for him since he's been on the Dodgers or not a love. I don't I don't I've just I've just always liked him as a player and the way he plays the game. And not having him in the starting lineup, like, sometimes I'm like, geez, I should really have him in the starting lineup because if he was in the starting lineup, as hot as he was in the front in the first beginning of the season to now, like, he was so good in the beginning of the season. I'd, I'd make him play off the bench and he'd hit three home runs in one game or two home runs and he'd have a bunch of RBIs. But, you know, as the season has gotten longer, he has not struggled, but it's not as consistent. But it happens, you know, like you're not you, you're not playing every day, like, you're not playing every day, you're maybe playing one game every series, like, I, I could see why he's struggling, in, in this series he's played back-to-back -back games, and I think Chris Taylor needs that, and as much as Jock Peterson has been struggling lately with the that, as that will end the bottom of the sixth, I do consider... Do I start CT3 over Jock Peterson? But I love having Jock in the lineup. He's such great pop, too. Like, this team is so explosive. They're so powerful. And I don't think this team could get any better. All one to Ronald Cooney Jr., the forcing fastball. This one will be hit the right field. Betts will catch it for the first out of the top of the seventh. I just love this team so much. It's, it's explosive. It's fun to play with. And I'm trying to win a World Series with this team. 
Dansby and now that will bring in Dansby Swanson, one for two. two trips to the plate First pitch from Wood will be hit hard, and Justin Turner's going to lay out and try and make a play. But Chris Tether will just pick it up and throw it to Seager, and that will be a base hit for Dansby Swanson, two for three night. All right, that will bring in Adam Duvall over two. Strike out and a ground out in the first so pitch the will be high ball. for ball one. As so 1 0 now to the ball. It's ball one. He's the 1 0 pitch. Two in the ball game so far. And now 2 0. Two Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher and the facing a guy pitch. that's not known to the be change up a will be line. hammered well, and Adam Duvall makes it a 3 2 game. Man, that was a swing from Duvall. Man, I've been talking so much Adam crap Duvall. about him. That's his 100th career the home run, home run in this it's the career of his, of his career. and that's the third well, one of this season. That was absolutely crushed. Man, Duvall must be here in my comments, and now they'll bring sure in Arch I mean, uh, Archivaria, and now that will be strike one. So, oh one one now, this game has just got intensified and just got a little bit more exciting. Like I said earlier, a three-run lead can mean nothing in MLB. Because just the the player you least expect it can strike at any time. One and two, one and two now. now. One's fouled off. Trying to get Alex Wood through the seventh. Dustin May the is warm in the bullpen, and the one-two pitch will be two and two. Two-two now to Andy Archivaria. The two-two forcing fastball will be fouled. Count remains two and two. Two-two now in the two-two pitch. With the knuckle curve will be three and two. If Alex Wood walks him or gives up a hit, I'm probably going to bring in Dustin May. Three like two changeup will so be fouled off. So Dustin May should be getting ready out there in the bullpen. The three two pitch, 83rd pitch of the night for Wood will be a walk. And uh, we're going to pull Alex Wood here. He's had such a great game, gave up two runs. And now we'll bring in Dustin May. Dustin May comes into this game with his 17th game appearance. Seven holds, whatever the hell that means. 23 in innings of work, 4.30 ERA. The ERA is so high, 16 uh, strikeouts, one walk. Righties destroy him, and pseudo lefties. So uh, this is always a risk when we put in Dustin May. But the first pitch to Tyler Flowers will be strike one. that one out of play for strike one. That was a good swing Still right there from the Tyler end. Flowers. The 0 1 cutter will be fouled off. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind May 2. just needs two outs. The 0 2 curve and will strike him out the for the second out. He didn't get it and he 17th the second strike out of the year in the, the first one of the night. Big strike out there with the tying and run now that will bring base. in. Now, who is this guy? Bro, that's Buster Posey! What the hell? Bro, that's Buster Posey! Buster Posey, what the fuck? When the hell did he get traded? Buster Posey hitting 233, one home run, and 10 RBIs. Oh my goodness. This just this this game just got even better. First pitch to Posey will be ball one. When the heck did the Giants trade Buster Posey? 1-0. And the 1-0 cutters. And Posey's gonna hit this one hard to left field. This could be trouble. Chris Taylor gonna pick the ball up. Uh Posey running the second. And we got him with a throw from, from Corey Seeger. But Adam Duvall does give him a uh, does attack in our lead and now it's 3-2 but when did Buster Posey get traded Luke Jackson is the new pitcher for the Braves this is his 30th game 29 innings 5.28 ERA guys bro when when did they trade when did the Giants give away Buster Posey and for who into the box Will Smith First pitch to Will Smith Swung will be hammered to left field. Well to deep left this field. one will well, be caught for the first out of the bottom of the, the seventh. As he winds up just shy of the Man, that is absolutely crazy. All over that first pitch of the inning, and he didn't miss it. Just I, I, I want to see what their I want to see what their team looks like now. Dead. Like Jock Peterson will grab a bat and hit. Hold on, let, let's see if I can look at the Braves team. Like, um, uh, I don't. I don't know. Oh, box score. Can they, can they show? Uh, they're like, no, it doesn't show the pitch hitters. For the pitcher here. Man, I'd love to see who they have on their squad now. Bust. Like, did the Giants trade anybody else away? Right center field. 
Oh man, if they traded Buster Posey, and the pinch hitter will who not else be could they have traded? The they could have traded like now. Evan Longoria, Crawford. Oh, please don't Ready say Crawford. Crawford, freaking Brandon Bell, Hunter. Pe like, bro, who did they trade? I, bro, I want to know so bad, but it's so cool Very to see Buster Posey on the Braves. That's unbelievable. 1-0. And now 1-1. One, one. This is absolutely crazy, He's but I gotta got stick to the game. I gotta focus. I can't think about the Giants the right now, the 1-1. One, one. And now 1-2-1, one, one, I mean, one, excuse me. Man, Buster Posey, what the heck? 2-1. And, ah, 2-2, two, two, darn it. Inside, but he pretty clearly broke the plane that time. Oh, two. Buster Posey is Atlanta Brave now. Never would think of that. This one's, one's gone. gone. That's 26th home run of the year. That one is into the left bull in, our, in the Dodgers bullpen. 26th home run of the year. And now Matt Beatty. Where you at, bro? <laughs> Betts holds Solo the first place in the end with the home runs all to himself now. And the season. first and pitch to Turner will be high for ball lead. one. So 1-0 one now like to Justin Turner. Mookie Betts, that was his 55th RBI as well. And this one's Swing hammered to center field. Justin Turner is going to have a home run back-to-back -back jacks for the Dodgers. 5-2, to 17th home run for Turner. And now that will bring in Matt Beatty and the new pitcher in Grant Day Dayton, who used to be a Dodger a long time ago, pitching 450. What can Matt Beatty do here? 0 for 3. And he hit one. Stepping in now, First pitch. And, and ball one. Great eye. 1 0 to Beatty. Could really use a knock here. 0 for, 0 for 3, 3 in the game so far. 1 0 to Beatty. He's ready. Here's the 1 0. This oh, one's gone. This one's gone. This one has to be Back gone. Marquez caught it. Oh my goodness. Nice catch on oh the my goodness. I thought Betts. I mean, I thought Beatty just tied Betts once again, but it's still two five Dodgers. And now we're going to bring in Bracey Scratterall with us having a three run lead. Pitching with a 1.15 ERA. This is his 15th appearance, 15.2 innings. Oh my goodness, and that will bring in Ozzy Albies. First pitch will be strike one. Bro, this that inning just made me feel like I was going to have a heart attack. I was so excited. 0-1. <laughs> and the 0 1 slider will be Adam hit the left field. This, this might drop. Uh, no, Chris Taylor, Taylor will catch it for the first out of the top of the eighth. One out. One. So one out here in the top of the eighth. And now, now that will bring in, in Nick, Nick Marquez, who's 1 for 3. Has. has Caught a couple of fly balls from Matt Beatty out there and right. I think that's the second time Matt Beatty hit one deep, but not far enough. 0-1, and now 1-1. 52,864 fans in attendance here tonight. 1-2. And, and I don't think I don't think none of them knew that Brand, I mean Buster Posey was on the Atlanta Braves. They probably did. They probably got the trade alert when uh, it happened. I wish it would tell me like trades what's happening around the league. Like that'd be cool to know, but it never really has. Like that'd be two outs, but it never really says. Oh, Posey got traded or this guy got traded. It, it just talks about your trades. All right, now that I'm bringing Freddie Freeman 0 for 3 pitch, in the first pitch way. from Bracer Scratterall will be hammered Ryan to left the field. This will, oh my goodness, I just missed one with CT3. Oh, this is going to be a double now. So oh no, oh, he's running now. CT3's throw will not be in there on time. So bad defense, it happens. They haven't had much luck so far tonight, Tenth so double year for Freddie Freeman, first pitch to Ronald Acuna Jr. will be strike one, one for three. And get back into this and thing. the one I mean the 0 one pitch hammered to left field go foul it will go and foul just barely oh my goodness the 0 two pitch from uh popped up Bruce Muncy. Dark Gratterall Muncy will foul. catch Territory. it to end this inning and let's go to the and bottom of the eighth the let's inning. start warming up the big gun Kenley Jansen in the bullpen bottom Bellinger to lead now. it off and that brings in the former National League rookie of the year Cody Bellinger the better fielder all right. 
First pitch to Cody Bellinger from Grant Dayton. Will be outside. Four ball, one, one for three tonight with a two run home run. So started the scoring 1 0. Well, Matty V, I don't know what your thoughts are, D Roll, but boy, when the weather starts to warm up and the ball starts jumping. And this one's gone. Bellinger just tied Beatty for second. Oh, my goodness. The three B's, baby. Bellinger, Betts, and Beatty. Bro, that sounds so good, and now that will bring in Corey Seager. Two for three. That would take the save away from Kenley Jansen. First pitch will be strike one. Five home run game. And we're going to sit down Jansen. We're going to start warming up Dylan Floro in the bullpen. All right, 0 1 pitch from Grand Dayton. And now 0 2. Quickly, 0 and 2. No outs, nobody on. All right, 0 2. The 0 2 pitch to Corey Seager will be popped, popped up the up. left. And Achavaria will catch Shading it. Shading to his right. He'll and he calls have it in the second out. First out of the inning. Now batting. now batting, Chris Taylor is working on a Chris. one for three thus far. Taylor. All right, now that bringing CT three one for three, and the first, first, first pitch, pitch from the Grand Dayton will and be low good for ball one. On good hold right there from CT three, holding that one up, and the one zero pitch to Chris Taylor will be hammered and fouled. There, but this is foul off toward the third base coaching box. 1-1 one, one to CT3. And the 1-1 one, one pitch will be hammered Ooh, and foul. foul. Darn it. Bases are empty, one, one two man. now to CT3. The 1-2 pitch from Grand Dayton. This is his 11th pitch. And a hammered to left field. Is corner. this one gone? CT3, let's go. It's gone. 7 to 2. Sixth home run of the night for the Dodgers. 15th home run of the year for CT3. Man, like I said, if he's hot, he's hot. And his home runs, bro, they could happen at any time for CT3. And now that will bring in Shane Green. Pitched yesterday. Pitching the ZRAs of 3.05. They're down by 5 now. And the and Braves the are now, struggling. The first pitch seat. will be so strike one. A bad one there. It's strike and the one. Braves came into this game being first in the NL East. I don't know if they will drop a drop a spot down, one out, nobody on. or drop in their division, or still remain first. I do not know what the NL East looks like. All I know is that. I feel like this oh, team is so disgusting how good time. we've been Some playing. Being 50, I think we're like two. almost 50. I think we're like, I don't even know our record, but I, I know we've lost three times, and Started that to tends to happen. There. Losses will happen, and, and I do know no that coming into these seasons, two. but in baseball, I feel like I should I should maybe Here have 20 two games two. lost by now, but I'm this team is such a good team, and... Yes, everyone knows I upgrade my teams to 99s, but bro, when you're playing on Legend and Hall of Fame, like, I think you should be allowed to do that, because if you pitch, like, one pitch down the middle, it's always gone, or, you know, something like that, but 2-2 two -two to Max Muncie, and now 3-2. And, and you know, not all my 99s are good. Look at Will Smith. I think three, like he don't hit a lot of home runs. He don't hit a lot of RBIs. But you know, it all depends. Three, two pitch will be fouled off. One out here in the bottom of the eighth. The three, two pitch from Shane Green. Hello, Coco. And the three, two. Will struck out Muncy with the two seam fastball. Nice. So now that will bring in Will Smith. He was really one for two. And not every pitch is good either. Like Dustin May, he's really struggled this season. So, oh, this one's maybe gone. This one is gone. Let's go, Will Smith. Eight to two. Tenth home run of the year. As I'm just talking about, he's not that good of a home run hitter. What does he do? He cranks one to left field and makes it freaking eight to two. 
You gotta be kidding, and now we're bringing Gavin Lux. Gavin Lux will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number nine. Hitting 266, seven home runs and 21 RBIs. First pitch from Shane Green will be. Oh, this one's gone. And driven out to right center field. A ball this has hit. to be gone. Nine to two. Man, I think that's our seventh home run of the night. Eight home. That's the eighth home run of the year. Yeah, eight home run game for the Dodgers. This is unbelievable. And now that will bring in Mookie Betts. We're trying to get the Matt Beatty here. We want to see him tie Mookie Betts. Darren O'Day. Oh, first pit. Strike one. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna start looking like my batter's looking silly here, just because O'Day is a submarine pitcher, and I cannot stand those pitchers. So one. I know too. Uh oh. Uh oh. This is not good. Yo, two to Mookie Betts. And the pitch from O'Day will strike him out with the high fastball. So I hate submarine pitchers. But Betts is first in the NL with home runs now. Then it goes Beatty Dylan and Bellinger Floral tied for second. Pen, to and uh, yeah, on, yeah. so now that I'll bring in night. Dylan Floor. This is his 17th start, 17.1 innings, 2.08 ERA. 16 strikeouts, 0 walks, 33.1 average against righties, lefties, he, he dominates, so pretty weird to see that, but uh, first pitch for Dansby Swanson now. is strike one. Is it's just, a, it's, you'd think it'd be the opposite way, but I don't know, 0-1 to Dansby Swanson and the 0-1 pitch will be fouled. Behind 0-2 now. Lucky he got a piece right there. And he the O2 change up. Wills. After seeing a previous he, off speed one and two now, and according to home plate. I mean, according to the first, place, first base no, umpire. The first base umpire. And it's the one and two slider will be and fouled. He fouls this one off. And the one two one fastball two from Dylan Floro will and strike him out for the first out of the box. I mean, at the top of the ninth. My dinner is done, so I better finish this game. All right, I'll bring in Adam Duvall, one for three. Duvall, with a two-run home run earlier in this game, and now strike one. Last time up. Yeah, and his last at bat, he hit a changeup out for a home run. So, so one pitch from Devin Flora, and the slider will be fouled. A little quick on that swing, and he oh, finds one. himself behind 0-2. And, and the 0-1 pitch will be 1-2. A one little bit two. off the outside, it's 1-2. 1-2. And the one two pitch from Flora will be fouled. fouled. Away. All right, one two. And the pitch will be hit to right field, and Betts right. will catch it for and the first time. will make the play out there, and there are two away now. All right, two outs, and now they'll bring Andy Archivaria. First pitch it will be struck one. In his last trip. Oh, and one the count. Now the pitch. Oh, one in the 0 1 pitch. And, and now it's one, one and one. Bases are empty here with two men out. Oh, 1 1 to enter Maria. And now Nine this one's hit the right, right field. Betts will Best. catch it to end there. the night here in Makes LA. So we win 9 to 2, a big game for the Dodgers. We get a win. Uh, Alex Wood gets the win. The and Mookie Betts is now sitting pretty in first, wavered. all by himself with Cody Bellinger. Tied with Beatty in the home run category. Hat player of the game. Eight home run night. And Buster Posey is the Atlanta Braves. So guys, like, comment, subscribe. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's finale against these Braves. And then we'll be greeting the Rockies on Thursday. Like, comment, subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow.